So welcome everybody in today's interview with the great Swami Vivekananda Saraswati, my loving uh, tantric teacher and teacher of my teacher, one of the best tantric masters I know. And he was so, so uh, nice and he agreed uh, to give me some time and answer a couple of my questions and yours as well. So Swamiji, thank you very much for making time and uh, being here and answering our questions. My first question would be actually, I'm really curious how your story started, you know, how your journey started. If you can tell us, you know, when did you feel the call for spirituality or Tantra or how actually this began? I was curious. And I was curious for uh, the most uh, extreme forms of learning. It means I was curious, first of all, in the limits of modern science. And then I discovered by reading that the mystical science is much more advanced than the modern science. Whatever the modern science plans to do, like to put satellites around the earth or things like that, the mystical science is way, way more advanced than that it is way, way more ambitious in its projects than that. And therefore, I uh, decided to go in the, the, the research of parapsychology, of paranormal phenomena, of parallel universes, of spiritual realities. So it really all started like a form of scientific curiosity. And then, of course, uh, sooner or later, I realized that it was more than uh, just a scientific curiosity, because it was something which was affecting me. It was something which was influencing me in a positive way, both in terms of health and emotions and mind and everything. And so um, it became... Uh, a, a passion, a hobby, because I wanted to taste the biggest things promised. You know, if you say that Ramakrishna did yoga and he got something, or if you say that Milarepa did yoga and he got something, then of course you say, I want to do yoga and to get the same or to get something similar. So what started like a curiosity, as soon as I realized the scope of what was being offered, then automatically I uh, went deeper and deeper into this. I have to say from the very beginning that um, in the beginning, I didn't know about Tantra. The fact that there exists a Tantric path, which leads to the higher accomplishments was not known to me. I knew only about the path of yoga, of pure yoga, not the Tantric yoga. Fortunately, the teacher who started teaching me yoga step by step, he was also interested in Tantra and he was practicing it. And then automatically, you know, first of all, it was an emulation. If my teacher is doing Tantra, then I want to be like my teacher and therefore I will do what he does. I'll practice what he practices. It also did fit with my nature in those days because I was a young man with a tremendous amount of energy, like extremely, extremely energetic person. And because of that, then the Tantra was like hand in glove with a meaning that uh, it was a method for me. So in this way, I started with curiosity. I started with research of the mysterious. No, I was interested in everything, in the UFO phenomena. I was have there been aliens on planet earth 40,000 years ago or not this kind of thing and then this took me to yoga as a mystical technology and together with yoga I found out also about the existence of tantra and the two went like this with each other like they entwined with each other and ever since that time I have been on the path of yoga and tantra. <laughs> 